Hello everyone, welcome back to a new video. Today we're going to be going inside of the head of Rainer while he's practicing before one of his uh, big matches in the last chance qualifier. He's playing against Sol and we're just asking him a couple of questions. So enjoy. All right, so Rainer's in a group with three Terrans, right? Bunny, Innovation and... Uh, Gabe. And, and Big Gabe, Hero Marine. And right now we're live in his head watching him practice against Sol, a solid European Terran player. Known for his best. economically focused style. Uh, one of the trademark builds that he does is uh, four CCs before three wrecks. <laughs> <laughs> and right now we're listening in straight here with, with Rainer. Rainer, <clears throat> talk to us. What is the plan for this game on a map like Death Aura? The plan is to go Muras. The plan is to go Muras. And yeah. is there a specific way we want to get into those Muras? I heard Elaser talk a lot about the two-base Muralisk. Is this something you are familiar with? And do you like it? No, I don't like it anymore. It used to be good, but now it sucks. So we're going uh, three base, 66 drones, just a standard, you know? Just the standard, 66 drones, and then you have to defend your opponent's push, right? Yes, but then we can go up to 80 sometimes. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Uh, it depends on the early game. Depends a bit on the early game. And on how many gases do we ideally want to be F when we're at these 80 drones? Is that seven gas, eight gas? Or are you I like about eight gases eight lately. Eight gas? So big Mura counts. And, yeah, and like uh, 25 Muras. Opening up with six queens, seven queens, or a bit dependent on build order as well? I don't know. We'll freestyle it. We'll freestyle it? Okay, fantastic. Yeah. Can we see the Reaper coming? Okay. That's big. That's big. <laughs> we yeah. know there's a Reaper now. <laughs> is, is it a rare occurrence on the European ladder? Yes, yeah, sometimes they... they have no Reaper. No Reaper, okay. So it's uh, quite big. Now we saw the Reaper coming. Nice. Now Piotr is great at microing. Please, so no, no swearing. No, not in no, the first sorry, five sorry, minutes. Sorry. There go my advertising <laughs> money, man. Sorry, sorry. I don't know how to beep things out yet. I'll have to learn that. Whenever I make videos with you, like half the time is spent me? muting part of the... Yeah. No, I... that's not me. No, every single time I have to mute like part of What is he doing? You... We got the tumor down. Are we happy with the timing on that tumor? Yeah, it's okay. As long as it doesn't die, it's fine. You're sending in the Overlord pretty early. Is that the... Yeah, because he tried to snipe it with the Marine. Mm. So I'm gonna hide it, I think. Okay. I think I juked him, honestly. Where's the Reaper? <clears throat> So just a quick peek in the mind of a man who just lost lost a tumor. How are we feeling right now? Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. I mean, you dealt some damage on the Reaper, right? And that is lasting. So. <laughs> yeah. We'll have uh, one more tumor now. One more tumor, nice. You know, usually you can tell when it's 3cc or not by the timing of the aliens, but does, the Piotr doesn't have that. Because he just makes aliens before the they starport anyways. Because when it's 3cc, they go starport and then aliens. Right, right, right. And it, But that it, doesn't work for Piotr because he's built different, you know? He's built different indeed. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, so we take our second gas as the layer starts. And a bailing nest very early. This is in case of any type of hellbat attacks. Yeah, it's mostly because I want the bailing speed. Mm. That's big. I mean, you could have built it 40 seconds later if it just was for the bailing speed, no? no but still, it's a bit of a safety bailing nest. Right, right. So what I said, rather than for the fast bailing speed. Okay, Kevin. I'm just making sure this is an educational video and the people need to You're be informed just correctly. at this point. Flexing my knowledge, my infinite yeah. wisdom. <laughs> You're off base knowledge. Spores uh, a little bit late, perhaps? No, or I have uh, one in the second base. Okay, and the rest should be... Okay. Oh, he has cloak. Yeah. Does seem like the spore on the third is in time as well. Yeah, I didn't even build it. So, would this be considered a, a good early game or a bit so-so? Well, so far it's not bad. I didn't lose any drones. 
now I lost one. Are you worried at all at this point? No. You're approaching the the wanted drone count, right? Actually going way above it at this point. Yeah, yeah. Pre-2 medevac. Because the early game was this good. It's okay, because the Banshee, Banshee opening uh, delays the medevacs a lot. Okay. As compared to like single viking stuff. Yeah, or 3cc. Yeah. Cool, cool. I don't know what Piotr is doing, honestly. He's splitting the benches. He's a madman. A madman he is indeed. He used three scans already. He's a bit uh, of pretending, honestly. So does that mean he probably wants to push hard on that fourth base? And, uh, yeah, yeah that's his uh, signature move. Signature he move. He always has tanks here. Three tanks, usually. Okay. We're ready for a run by. Okay, and then the defense will be consisting of banelings with speed and a couple of queens. Look at this guy. He's pushing with everything. And that should be sufficient in your opinion? No. Because I forgot baling speed. Oh, you forgot to micro beat. So both of you forgot something? I'm dead, I think. Now, ideally, this would be the timing for some Muralis, I guess, but... Yeah, yeah. Lacking a little bit in Larva, and the lack of a fort <laughs> base is starting to hurt as well at this point. <laughs> uh, wow. You sniped the bailing, do you see that? Uh, no, I wasn't paying attention to that. I was thinking of the next joke I was gonna make. Wow, he's dropping on top of my queens. Do we consider that move worth it? He lost four or five marines. No, he lost five marines. Yeah. <laughs> you know, these are the little things Terrence do to try to style on you. Hmm. When they're ahead. What do you think his supply currently is? <clears throat> his supply? Yeah. And red 30. Maybe higher, I don't know. Does he have eight racks? What is this? Six racks? Six racks? I don't care about this one. Uh, and, and you believe you're in a inferior position than your opponent? Kinda, yeah. Okay. Unless it's really hard. There we which go could again. be the case. Your constant swearing is very off-putting for the younger viewers. I don't care. Yeah, I'm gonna actually have to review this. <laughs> <sighs> now you can't post. No, oh, yeah, me. it's over. That's three yeah. edits I'll need to make. I, what's this was on purpose. What is he doing? Are these good trades for you? Yes! He's trolling. Okay, so we see your Mura count is already at 10 at this point. What What is the ideal Mura count that we're working towards? 25. 25. Okay, and uh, we're not planning on ever leaving Muralisk at that point, or perhaps a transition into Ultras is, is on the table in the later stages of the game? Maybe. I, I, I'm not a fan of Ultras, but mm. sometimes you have to. Like, usually when you have a big bank, it's fine. Uh... Ah, 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 ah. Is there anything we want to do in terms of setup at this point? Not really, I just want to attack with Muras and defend with Palings. 
I, I can't really do too much because I was a bit behind. Mm. Ideally, you'd be more in control and be able to do some runbys yourself, or yeah, like maybe this army I could. Uh... Oh, he doesn't have bathing speed. Uh, I mean, mine speed. Drones. What would, what would you say uh, your biggest strengths are in game, Rainer? If you were to make a SWOT analysis of yourself, I think uh, speed and the brain mostly. Speed and the brain; those are your two strengths. Yes. And your weaknesses? Ah, uh, nothing, nothing. <laughs> too nothing fast. Too Sometimes yeah, <laughs> the exactly. keyboard lights on fire. <laughs> Nice. Uh, is the hive properly timed or perhaps a bit late? It's a bit late, but I, I lost the, the fourth place. Like, this game should be over. Mm. Uh, concerning your your opponent's position, what are we feeling? He probably has 3-3 on the way. E, please. I knew it. And, and what else? Like, do, do we think he's up in supply? Does he have a bank? Yeah, he's up in supply. I mean, I'm uh, maxed, so he's maxed as well. He has probably two medivacs flying around, snipe, trying to snipe my Muras. That's what he does. Because he can't keep up uh, with the Muras sometimes. What is this? Is he trolling me? He could have ten leaps uh, hiding in the base because I don't see any... Like usually they want to split their army, but like that this wasn't really a split. It was just ten marines on one side. Okay, you, you see, he's attempting to take a base on the right side. Definitely now. has twenty leaves hiding somewhere. I'm I'm smelling them. Like he has no medivacs. Look at this. My muras are. He's gonna fly ten leaves in my muras. I can smell it. Unless he's really pretending. Where are they? Is this a crushing moment? Is this a decisive moment in this game, you think? Yes. A snipe the space. <laughs> no. He lifted it. Who could have thought <laughs> that the orbital would go up in the sky? Ah, it's okay. I think uh, he's pretending, honestly. So from now on out, this fifth base is going to be a, a point where you're going to keep pushing a mat, right? The fifth base? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, he tries uh, to actually the it. third base as well. Like, I want to just split the Muras. Hmm. Attack with the Muras on that base. Ah, see, he has the Thors. Ooh. Like, in this case, Ultras are not bad. The more Thors, the better Ultras become? Kinda, yeah. I can run by this. Spread some creep. Like, I'm honestly surprised he doesn't have 10 leaps hiding in this base because I don't know what he's do he was doing otherwise. Yeah, it's funny because you could smell it. Good trades. Well, what would you consider a good trade? Because it's obvious a lot of these trades aren't cost efficient. I mean,. They, you can't really trade uh, efficiently against them. So. Right, so, so what would you consider a good trade? Is that they're a good trade? Like this one, for example. Yeah, but what defines a good trade? I shut up, Kevin. Holy shit. I don't know. Like this. His mind's exploding in his bio. That's a good trade. That's a good trade. Yeah. <laughs> that's there's a good there's trade. no numerical there value we can put on it. A number, that means numerical, by the way. Like, what is he doing? Where is his army? Was that a good trade? Which one? The one with Me the killing his base? The mine? That was a good trade. Like, come on, you have 10 leaps, no way. So, how are we feeling now? We're not maxed. Uh, plenty of larva though to remax. Yeah. Uh, are you afraid to lose a base? No. no? Okay, maybe that was uh, not a good trade. Right. I think I'm starting to get a hang of this good trading and bad trading. Yeah? Yeah. Nice. Okay. Go. Vroom. 
you think perhaps he should have split his army here or i think he's just dead he's just dead yeah but for no reason really he should be winning this game so what do you think the the turning point was I don't know, I think he, I feel like he kind of stopped playing, honestly, at some mm. point. Too passive? I, I just I just felt like he had too little stuff. Is that a common move you do, where you tank the mineshot with an overshare? Yeah. And rebuild a new one, so to take it out later? That's a good trade. That's a good trade, okay. Do <laughs> you have Adrian Glance? Wow, perfect game. You I think he'll lift? You think he'll lift? What? Vroom. Nice. Did you feel fast this game? No. What do you think your APM was? My APM? Yeah. 460. Yeah, 607. Wait, really? Yeah. You're wow, really quite so quick. Fast. Yeah. Well, you're, you're it's not because of coming? the rapid fire and the fast. Oh, oh, sorry. Oh. Not again. Not again. <laughs> hey, leave the game. What are you doing? Oh, man. I'm going to have to make a note now. Like yeah, five. yeah, you can't post the game anymore. No, no, I can't. Trust me. You I'll can? figure out how to bleep. I just need to swear a little more then. It's just giving me more work. But it's coming online no matter what. Dang it. Can we leave the game now? At this point, is there any suggestions you could make to your opponent? <laughs> leave the game? <laughs> <laughs> I'm making 60 mutas now. K K uh, Lambo. Lambo, you here? What, are you doing YouTube content or what's happening? Kevin is. Can you tell him to leave? I don't know. I'm not... I don't know what you guys are doing. I'm not referee. This is YouTube I'm content. I'm playing as Piotr, but he's not leaving. So you're just observing Piotr versus uh, Rainer? Yeah, yeah, one game. And uploading it to YouTube? <laughs> no, no, no. Asking, the... asking the big questions. Free content right there. That's free content. Was this a good trade, Rainer? Yes. Nice. Should I max out on Muras? Max out on Muras, I think. Only Muras? Only Muras. Yeah. Let's take this, this, and this. Max Aro Mura's time. Wow. That's a lot of mines in it. Yeah. Quite impressed. Oh. Your creep threat was very good this game, wasn't it? Never Average. contested. <laughs> Hello? It's time to go. Please! Piotr, what are you doing? Like, actually, what's his supply? 76? 89. Wow. But he has 15 workers, so his army is quite sizable. <laughs> He's splitting like a madman. Splitting like a madman. Oh. That was a nice drone micro. You think I can take on his army with only Muta? I think you can. What's your upgrades? Plus three? Plus two. Plus two. Yeah. Should have played double spire for you. Yeah. Extra carapace upgrades. GG. Well done. Uh, any quick thoughts? Summary? Damn, 270 APM. 618 average APM. Do you believe Damn. you're the fastest? The fastest uh, alive? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is it possible? <laughs> no. No. Okay, nice.